Jeezy, if you got me. Jeezy. Okay, right. I'm losing my mind. I feel like I should like frolic through a sunflower field. There's nothing to complain about, is there? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, as you can probably tell by the title, I'm doing a poly haul. So this is actually the first proper time that I've bought stuff from my poly. Um, I've bought a dress off Depop off them before. It was my 21st birthday dress. It was their Stargazer one. Oh my God, it was so pretty. I got the pink one. And then I've also bought a bikini off them before when they were doing a sale, but I didn't really like. So this is gonna be like a first impressions Opoly haul because I've bought six dresses. Um, I've opened the boxes, but I haven't really looked at them. I haven't tried any of them on. And this is the first time that I've properly like purchased a dress off them instead of like Depop. Trying out the sizes, the style, how it fits on me. Cause I'm sort of like, I'm like a size nine. Like I'm sometimes an eight, sometimes a 10. So I've actually ordered all of mine in a size eight because when I did wear the Stargazer dress, I think I got it in a size eight, but because it was so stretchy, it was sort of a bit baggy as well. Um, so I should have eaten size down to size six, I think, which is not really usually my size. I think I got some of the most expensive ones on their website. And I also got some of the most popular ones. So I'm really interested to see what they're like. So this is like a try on testing a poly sort of haul, like the, is it worth it? So these are my boxes. They came in two boxes, two separate parcels because I did end up doing them in two separate thingies for some reason. I'm pretty sure with Opoly the delivery is free but you pay to return it. This is the dress on the top that I think was the most expensive out of the lot. So the first dress that I have is called the Silver Lining Underwired Glitter Bodycon Mini Dress in purple. I've got it up on my iPad. Um, so this was £60. It's now on the website for £55 and I got this one in a size 8. Um, did I say it was purple? I think I did. Well, yeah, it's purple. And it's really, really glittery. This one's actually from the Tammy Hembrow collection. So this one was, yeah, one of the most expensive ones that I found on, on that at that time. It's like shedding glitter. The color actually looks insane on camera. I mean, it looks insane in person as well. So I like, I wouldn't have actually bought this in purple. Like I love purple, but I'm more into like calmer, like neutral colors at the moment. Um, but this was one of the ones that was on the page when I was on it. It's actually so pretty. Can you see how glittery it is? It's like a little mermaid. It's quite stretchy. It's got a zip at the back. The thing with Opoly, like it is amazing quality. Like the things that I have had off there or seen like other people have from them, they are always amazing quality, like the bikinis and everything. Next up we have this one. So this is the dress that I'm pretty sure will be the one that I'd keep if it fits all perfectly and everything. So this one is called the Pretty Simple Bodycon Dress in Oyster White. And I basically saw it and I was like, that's just the dress that you'd have to like chuck on whenever you want to like feel good and like look put together and simple without trying too hard. So it's basically just a mini dress in this, like I said, oyster white, it's sort of like stony sandy colour. And um, this one's in a size eight as well, I think. Yeah. And it's like double lined with really thick quality. And I love the square neck and the thick straps. You can dress this one up or dress it down. Um, and it's a really nice colour to just put with anything sort of thing. But the only thing I'm worried about is if it, because it's a mini dress, if it is like a little bit like too short. This one's usually £35. At the moment, when I'm looking at the website, it is on offer for 32 So £3 discount. Bargain. And then the last one in this box is the Treasured Love Rouge Bodycon Dress in Oyster White as well. Um, the Oyster White is a different colour on this one than it is on the other one. But this is the dress that I saw like, everyone wear last summer. One of the main O-Poly dresses that you see. So it's usually 50 quid. It's on the website at the moment for 40, if that helps anybody. The sale probably might not still be up by the time this video is up. But this is very structured. So there's the like ruched and um, like bardo sleeves. And then it's obviously a mini dress as well. These are the sort of dresses that I'm not sure will fit because when I say I'm an eight, I'm an eight on the top, but I'm like a 10, sometimes even a 12 on the like bottom and thighs area, if you get what I mean. Um, so these ones, I mean, it has got shape to it. 
so I'm hoping that it might fit but sometimes I don't really want to like break the zip if you know what I mean but, I mean if it goes and it like sucks me all in and it's all like perfectly fit then I guess there's nothing to complain about, is there? So, second box. So, this dress is the Under Your Spell Underwired Embellish Mini Dress in gold. So, personally, this dress wouldn't be something that I would usually wear. Um, it wouldn't be the colour that I'd go for. My style isn't really, like, that sparkly in a way. I mean, I know I said that my 21st birthday dress had, like, the diamante bits, but that's a little bit different. It was my 21st. This just reminds me of Disney. Like, Beauty and the Beast, Belle sort of vibes. Why do I keep saying vibes? I don't know the word vibes, but I mean, sometimes there's just no other word for it, so. This one was like the same reason why I got the one from Tammy Hembrow, the purple one, um, was because this one was one of the most expensive and one of the most popular on there at the moment when I was looking. So this one is so heavy, which is like, screams good quality, which is a good thing. And it's so well structured, like this is a well-made dress. Like if you buy this and you want this, you're in for a good time because this is really well made. So this one's regular price is £60. At the moment, it's on there for £50. They've also got other colours that are cheaper. Um, but here it is. And it goes. It's honestly beautiful. And it's got a back zip as well, as they all do, I think. That's a really well concealed zip. Sorry, my like textiles sewing seamstress self is coming out but look how well like literally you can barely see the zip well you can see the top bit but look well done oh poly seamstresses the thing with cups is like everyone always talks about is like it's hard fitting every size into cups when they're like this and underwired one of the gems just fell off i mean yeah, one did just fall off, which isn't the best, but I mean, I can't really tell where it came from, which I guess is kind of a good thing. And the model looks amazing, so... Wish I could look like that. So this is one that was out of stock in the 8, so I had to get a 10 in this one. So I guess it would be a good reflection to see whether, like, I'd fit better in a 10 or an 8. Right, this is the next one. Um, this is the Ocean Shimmer Embellished Satin Bodycon Dress. Again, in Oyster White, and it's another version of the oyster white color but i mean i mean it's going to be in different and different fabrics isn't it this one i just always think of maura higgins when i see these dresses because this is the one that she wore on love island in like the orange color this one's usually 48 at the moment it is 44 um first thing is i feel like the straps are really really long but they are adjustable which is great and here it is a lovely satin it seems a little bit see-through even though satin usually always is but it's double lined which is amazing and it's got these amazing straps that are like encrusted with like loads of different like gemstones and silver and stuff and then it's the same along here along the under the bust obviously so this one was a size 8 as well this is one of the ones which like i wouldn't usually get but i knew it was a really popular one on no poly so i thought i'd pick that one up to try and then finally is the midnight romance satin bodycon dress these are all bodycon i think opoly is like very bodycon mini and like tight to the physique and everything i think opoly is like the go-to for anyone who wants to dress this dress i picked up purely because i thought it was beautiful like this isn't a color that i usually wear and i don't think i've ever really owned anything in this color but it's just, uh, it, it just speaks for itself, doesn't it? So the colour is just blue. Why did I think it was going to be called something amazing? <laughs> it's just literally just blue. Rouge cup detailing, which I just think looks amazing. They look like little shells, don't they? These are all very like mermaidy. I'm going to feel like I'm literally aerial. Um, but yeah, this one just goes down into a normal bodycon again. And this one's in a size 8 as well. Oh, it's actually called Galaxy Blue on here. Adjustable straps again. And the straps feel like a really nice, they sort of go out a bit and then get thicker and then come back to the adjustable bit, which I really like that. But yeah, so they're all the dresses. A lot of people say to size down and a lot of people say to size up. So I think it really depends on what dress and also what fabric you're getting it in. 
So that's why I thought I'd get like a range of them. But yeah, I'm basically gonna try them on. And then when I've got them on, if I can get them on, I will tell you guys how I feel. So BRB. So here's the first dress. This is a Tammy Hembrow one. It will not stop shedding glitter. Like there's just glitter all over the flat. It fits so nicely. I haven't got a bra on this one. It feels really supportive because it's got the underwire. Sucks me in at the waist. Allows the curve to curve. If you look back, you can see the back. And I don't know, I really, really like it. Very, very nice colour. This one is amazing. I feel really comfortable in it. It's very, very pretty, but I just don't really have anything to wear it to. I'll let you know which one's got my Depop. My Depop's always blow in the box. So um, definitely check it out if you want these Oakley dresses off me for cheaper. Next, I've got the dress that I said would probably be my casual dress that I'm most excited to see what it looks like on and possibly keep. Um, it does feel really, really amazing. Like it definitely, gives you the shape and everything. I love the square neck. I think that like, this is such like a nice detail on dresses to have to make it like a little bit more different. You can definitely dress this one up and down. Um, it's got, that's what the back looks like. But like I said, like I'm worried about it being a bit too short. I wouldn't really have a problem with this one because it feels like even you could pull it down a bit. I guess when you move like up, it might go a bit, but that's just the same with every dress. So for the bra situation, like I said in one of my last videos, I'm not a free the nip kind of gal. So I've got one of the bandeau bras. It's definitely not the best bandeau bra that I can find at the moment. So I just checked anything on, but I feel like it does the job. It doesn't look like you've got a bra on. You can't really see that many like bumps and lumps by the other bra. Um, I've just got some new pants on. I don't think you can see it. I was a bit worried in the mirror, but I don't know whether that's because I knew they were there sort of thing, if you know what I mean. I think this one's a winner. Yeezy vibes, this is what it is. It's like very Yeezy vibes. Hate that word, why do I keep using it? What's a different word for vibes? Yeezy, if you got me. Yeezy, okay, right. I'm losing my mind. I'm gonna go on to the next one. This one I knew would be tight. It's that sort of fabric that doesn't really give enough stretch. It's beautiful. I feel like I should like frolic through a sunflower field. You can definitely tell that it's quite tight. I had quite a struggle getting it up by myself but it's got that little it's got the little hook and eye fastening so somehow I managed to get that on in the mirror. Don't know how. Let's just say I really wouldn't be able to go out on this. I mean I have been eating really badly and it's March and I've still got my winter weight so maybe in summer I could but um I personally just don't feel as comfortable in this one as I do in the others. It still looks nice. Um, I still feel supported and everything and like definitely feel sucked in. Um, and this bit's really nice, quite crunchy. <laughs> I really, 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 really like the little ruffle detail that it has at the bottom. I didn't know it had this, but that's really, really cute. But if you guys like this sort of dress, um, and you are a size 8. <laughs> Check out my Depop. Here is the most expensive one, I'm pretty sure. And the only one that I did get in a size 10. And for now that, you can definitely tell that this one is a size 10 and that I should have got an 8. So it's like, the last one was an 8, way too tight, should have got a 10. This one's a 10. Too loose, should have got an 8. Not my captain. Sorry, magpie. <laughs> I'm very superstitious. But I feel like with an 8, you would get that, like, like sort of... You'd feel tight, you'd feel sucked in in a good way sort of thing and it would like give you more shape definition. I mean, you still have definition of shape, don't get me wrong. But I know with an eight, like the other ones, I probably would have felt even more sucked in, which would have made me feel like I felt better in the dress sort of thing. And no more boots have come off yet. It's difficult with like dresses like this, sometimes they're a little bit itchy and scratchy. <laughs> Simpsons. I mean, you can like feel that you've got the gems on and you can like feel it on your skin sort of thing, but they're not exactly itchy and I don't think they would irritate me if I wore this to like an event or something. It's still really, really nice. And um, this one will be on my Depop as well. Next is the Maura Higgins dress. Here is the Maura dress, <laughs> as I like to call it. This one's a size eight as well, but not gonna lie, I actually could have probably done with a six in this because it's got like, it's stretchy, but it's got room, like, do you know what I mean? So I've got the bra on again with this one. I don't know if you can tell, yeah, a bit there, but I mean, you can always tuck it in if you're like me and prefer to wear a bra like this with this one. Um, I've kept the tissue on them because 
I think I'm selling this one. Definitely glad that they are adjustable straps because I did need to adjust these ones. And um, still gives you shape as they all do, which is amazing. This is why I'm really, really enjoying these dresses and recommend it Polly. I'm pretty certain, like 90 99% sure that it isn't see-through. I mean, if you can see stuff like my pants, then I guess that it isn't. I do really, really like this dress. Yeah, again, it's not really my vibe. Why do I complain that much? It's not really my sort of thing. Can we please take a moment for the colour of this dress? Beautiful. Just beautiful. So this dress is beautiful. Um, the straps are a little bit tight, but that's because they have to be, because they're quite wide set. Oh! Oh! 100%. Hi, yeah, hi, I'm royal, yeah. Anyway. Um, but yeah, they have to be a little bit tighter so that you can eventually get them on your shoulder. And so they kind of go like this a little bit. Um, maybe not the most comfortable, but beauty is pain, my friends. Beauty is pain. I feel sucked in. The only thing with this one is I feel like it is like the tiniest bit too small. Like I feel like a 10 would still be a bit too big. And I feel like I could probably go out in this one. But like, you know when you can definitely feel it. Like, not like breaking or like ripping the seams apart, but you know, when you can sort of like feel it struggling a little bit. I mean, I haven't even been able to get it up. I'm not very, I'm not very stretchy, but yeah, it's definitely the top bit that's a little bit too tight. Gives me shape. I don't know why I keep doing this, but I guess, you know, when everyone's like, give us a spin. Yeah, that's what I'm doing for you guys. I can hear you in this camera, like, give us a spin. Yeah. Yeah as a top stunning if you're a bit in between sizes like me i would probably order both the sizes that you're in between look at that little bit of chub love yourselves i was trying to sign off the video and then the maintenance guy came in and i'm like literally trying on dresses midday but oh well so i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope it helped out because i know that when i was looking on o poly i wasn't sure on sizes now i've got like a vague idea but I'm gonna be honest it just depends on the dress. I'm probably going to keep the oyster white bodycon, the simple one that I said about because I knew I was probably going to keep that anyway. I might keep this one, I'm not sure yet. I also really, really like the purple one, which um, I didn't expect to like, but I felt really, really secure in that. Just saying, none of this was gifted to me. I wish it was, and I wish I was in collaboration with Poly, but I'm not. Um, all of this was paid for out my own money. A lot of them will be on Depop, like I've said, so definitely check that out down below. Also check out my Instagram. Um, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment to this video and turn your post notifications on. Um, and I think that's it. I enjoyed this video. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys, and I hope you have a lovely day. Bye.